So we're going to show you how to put the jockey ball wheel kit on the Sabre 350. Now, first thing we need to do is tilt the machine away from you and just push the block of wood underneath that will secure the machine in place while we put the fabrication on. Now, this can be done before we build the bandsaw up by just attaching the wheels to the cabinet before there's any weight there. But if you buy the wheel kit after, as an add-on, the machine's already in place, this is probably the safest method to do it. Um, you may need a bit of help tilting the machine to put the wood underneath, but if you feel safe doing it on yourself, then that's fine. So we've secured the machine, we've got the fabrication, we've got two M8 bolts. Now there's a clearance hole in each corner of the cabinet, so we can offer the fabrication up and screw through that will hold a right hand side in place first of all and then obviously through the clearance hole and secure the left hand side in place. Just nip these up at first finger tight to make sure it's secure in position and when this is done we can use the 13mm spanner just to secure into position. So once that's done, everything's nice and firm. Again, we can just tilt the machine away from us, bring the wood over and out of the way. Put the machine back down onto the base, nice and secure. So now we've done one side, we're going to put the wheels on the other side. Again, we're going to push the machine away from us using the spine and secure underneath with the uh, block of wood. That keeps the machine in place. Then, what we're going to do is the, the axle and the first wheel. So the first wheel goes on, then the washer, and then the split pin goes through the hole on the end, and we can open that up to make it secure. Bring the wheel back towards it. Then we can push the axle through the hole that's already pre-drilled in the machine, offer up to the hole on the opposite side and push through and just repeat the wheel, washer and split pin. Again, bend the split pin over one side and it's as simple as that. All we need to do then is just take the weight of the machine to bring the wood out, drop that back down and then we're ready to use the jockey bar wheel kit, draw that in, allows us to take the bandsaw away. Again, hope that's been helpful. Any questions, please come back to us.